Hi, welcome back to the 30 day gratitude system. Today is day 12. How are you doing? In the last 11 days, we discussed about several aspects of growth mindset, self leadership, personal mastery, and we tied all those together with a thread of gratitude. Today, I would like to revisit some of the most important aspects of that so that you can take action. And I'm going to give you a free resource today. So watch till the end of this segment so that you can find the link to that resource and make use of that resource. We all have dreams. What are some of your cherished dreams? You see, all of us have many cherished dreams and many of those important dreams remain as dreams, remain in our booklet of New Year resolutions. Whenever we think about that, we feel dissatisfied with ourselves, the way we conduct our work, the way we are not able to focus on those dreams. And generally, we don't feel contented. The dearer the dream is, the sharper the pain is. Today, I would like you to think about some of those cherished projects, cherished ideas, some of those cherished dreams you have. And I would like you to think about the constraints. The constraints are many. You might not have the support from your family members to venture into a dream project. You want to achieve that dream promotion, but your boss is standing on the way. You have a fantastic idea about a product or an organization, but you don't have enough money to achieve that. So there are many different constraints that chain us down and hold us back from proceeding with our cherished ideas and cherished dreams. Now, what are the constraints that you are facing? Now, I would like you to take a step back. Are these the constraints that are holding you back? For example, if you have a fantastic idea about a product and your constraint is money, think about this. If there is a great idea, there are people who are ready to invest into that idea. So money should not be a constraint that is holding you back. It could be something else. It could be the fact that you are not convinced yourself about this product and hence you are not able to present it to others. It could be that you, you don't know how to approach these investors. It could be that you don't know how to proceed with the work once you get the funding from those investors. Of course, there are external constraints, but to a certain extent, we can overcome these external constraints by identifying our internal constraints and taking the measures to lighten those constraints so that our external constraints will also get smaller and smaller. So the gratitude theme for today is breaking the barriers to discover your breakthroughs. Trust me, once you identify your personal constraints, it is easier for you to break those constraints and discover your own breakthroughs. So the gratitude task for today, the first component of that, the gratitude component is think about a time you overcame some of your personal constraints to achieve something. Some of those personal constraints that, that I find in people are the need for developing some essential skills. For example, if you want to present it to a group of investors and you are terrified of speaking in public, that's the personal constraint that you are facing. So find the personal constraints that you overcame and achieved something. Do your gratitude routine for that. Your gratitude routine could be writing a journal, talking to people about it, talking to the people involved, uh, sending them a note, sending them a message, giving them a call and so on. Please acknowledge how grateful you are to break those personal constraints and achieving what you achieved. And the second component of a gratitude task, which is the action component, for that I would like you to do a deep dive inside. Select the three cherished dreams that you have. 
and for that cherished dream what are the constraints that you think you are facing and for each of those constraints these are external constraints that i am talking about for each of those external constraints list down some of the internal constraints that are causing fully or partially that external constraint if you identify the personal constraints it is easier for you to identify the action for overcoming those personal constraints and if you would like to have a template i have my ebook plus workbook it's called breaking the barriers of personal constraints you can download it from the link below i hope you will be able to make the best use of this resource as well as this activity because this is the time you can do something about your dreams this is the time when you can remove that dream from your new year resolution altogether because when it is time for the new year resolution for next year you might have already started doing some work on that resolution on that dream i wish you all the best believe in yourself never ever think that you can't achieve your dreams i'll see you tomorrow with another gratitude task till then be confident in yourself be confident about your dreams keep dreaming be safe be happy bye bye